Hello Scorpio and welcome to your Twin Flame reading for June 2020. We're going to use three powerful decks of cards for you to bring in some messages and see what's going on in June. So thank you for being here, sending you so much love and if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day and there will also be a reading on here for your Divine Masculine, whatever sign they are, there will be a message for you. So we're going to use the Guardian Angel angel reading cards today the witch's tarot and the angel affirmations to really get into the heart of what's going on and a really powerful reading for you this month Scorpio because it's all about keeping going to not give up because you've been encouraged that victory is on the horizon so go and watch the general reading because it will blow you away okay this is what you need to know then thank you angel what's going on with scorpio twin flames wow one on the floor as well what's going on please with scorpio twin flames what do we need to know wow powerful things happening in in june i can see it already what's coming here wow what's going on please angels and scorpio to win flames look at this amazing wow a lot of cards coming out it's going to be a powerful one so i'm going to start here with the page of cups and as you know this card is all about communication it's about love coming in and the most powerful thing here is that you've got this with the chariot so this is showing you that communication is definitely coming in and it's coming in between now and july it's showing you a fast forward motion that your masculine will communicate and show you love. You may be feeling this tidal wave of emotion this month because you know it's happening. You can feel it in your bones. You know there's a change and wow, look at that. You've also got the eight of wands. Super powerful. You couldn't get more powerful cards coming out than that for forward motion. It means movement, travel, things changing, things happening and communication coming in. So if you don't get communication this month, which I highly doubt because, you know, it's showing you it's coming. So I doubt that you don't like you do get it. You don't get it. The same. you have to release confusion. Okay, so you could be confused. Well, my masculine hasn't contacted me for a long time. Is it going to come in? I feel the masculines are in and out of this fear energy about it, do's and don'ts. They're confusing me when I'm talking about it. So the back and forth in their energy. One minute they want to communicate to you, the next minute they go into fear. So it's about trusting. So if it doesn't come in in June, it's definitely coming in around July time. So you have to keep the faith here trust the process if you feel it you know it's real it's coming in but it's definitely moving forward the love all of this your masculine wanting to show it to you and yes it can feel like hard work but you know what it's worth it this journey is so worth it because victory will be yours and this was the message that's come out during the general reading that victory will be yours even if you feel trapped right now even if your masculine is trapped in a situation, victory will be yours because the world is in your hands and you're receiving the promises here, the promise of freedom, the promise of things moving forward, of flight, of change, the promise of bravery, of courage, of your masculine growing up spiritually and coming towards you with an offer with love the promise of union there with the stag so you're being shown the truth and we've got the angel of dreams there so you're connecting with each other in dreams you're showing each other the way you're being guided and this is a number 10 for power so the power is in your dreams. It's what you visualize, what you think about, you bring about. So the angels are asking you to keep the faith and to trust in what you're dreaming. Because you're dreaming about the future, you've been shown the way. And if you're dreaming about things that need to be released, it's because you're purging things out. If you're dreaming about what you're desiring, you're purging things in, you're bringing things in. And you're connecting with each other in dreams. You're telling each other how you feel. You're communicating. You're showing each other that this is moving forward. Your masculine will be reminding you of their presence in your dreams. Showing you it's moving forward. That surrender is the key. And I love this because this is where we are right now. We have to trust the journey. We have to surrender to heaven and trust with full faith and, and healing that it's coming in. It's happening. 
there is no point in pushing the barrow up such a steep hill. So this is about let it be, don't try so hard, go back to the start, surrender your expectations, there is an easier way, when the time is right a new path will appear. So the angels are showing you it's moving forward, you don't have to force it, it's moving forward to where it needs to be let go of those expectations because expectations cause fear and be grateful and this is another thing that came up in the general reading gratitude so make sure you're being grateful for your life being grateful for your journey it will move it forward it will bring in power and it will bring in strength make gratitude your new attitude the stars will shine brighter upon you and everything in your world will become lighter We've got the angel of procrastination. So your masculine is being guided to let go and make a decision. You may be being guided to let go and make a decision, but the angels are definitely showing you here that your masculine is communicating with you right now through music, showing you that they are making up their minds, that they are deciding what to do, that they are working things out. And make sure you're grounding yourself having sacred space for you to tune into you, to connect with heaven, to connect with your source of all things. And again, there we go. We've got gratitude. Have gratitude for this journey because, wow, look at this. We've got the angel of unity. So it's showing you that union is coming in. You'll feel united this month with your divine masculine because you're surrendering, you're being grateful, you're giving it to heaven and you're not giving up on this path because the angels of the universe are showing you how powerful you are and how powerful this connection is and that when you believe, you receive. You've got the angel of past lives as well. You're healing things. You're cleansing things from the past. There's great power coming in. And your masculine is moving towards you out of the darkness into the light. The angel of positivity. Amazing things flowing in. We've got inspiration for you. A new idea comes to you like a gen a new idea comes to you like a gentle whisper inside your heart. Listen and take action. This is inspiration from high above. So I feel you've both been inspired. You're being inspired to be grateful, to trust the journey, to understand the journey. And your masculine has been inspired to move towards you now, to speak up, to communicate with you, to bring it in. Gaining the courage and the wisdom that's needed to bring it in, to bring it home. You have what it takes. Just do it. We, your angels, are here to support you. So there's power coming in. So this is showing me that your divine masculine is taking control this month. And this is showing you, Scorpio, that you are strong and powerful. And that when you have the attitude of gratitude, when you trust the journey, when you focus on your dreams, and you know in your heart and soul that it's moving forward, that things are changing, that the love and the communication is coming in, even when it's hard work and that victory is yours, you'll be safe and you'll be shown the way because there's a great healing coming in and the connection is being healed right now. The angel of healing is with you right now. So Archangel Raphael is speaking to you. Feel my presence and my unwavering love for you. I have loved you before the dawn of time and I will love you for all eternity. And the angels are saying that's also a message from your beloved. That's coming through right now from your divine masculine. Feel my presence and my unwavering love for you. I am with you right now. I have loved you before the dawn of time and I will love you for all eternity. Your masculine needs you to know that right now. And that's why the healing angels are around you, healing your heart and healing this situation, moving it forward. At this very moment, you are being bathed in gold, pink and deep green light. Accept this healing. The angels surround you with wings of love. You are eternally free, eternally fresh and eternally abundant. So powerful. The angels are with you right now. They're also guiding you to work on your creativity and your creative potential to go forward towards your dreams and your desires and the things that you're trying to create for you. You are by nature infinitely creative. Life is a sea of creative potential just waiting to be expressed through you. 
You are free to express all of your heart's desires. And wow, Archangel Metatron is with you, the angel of divine timing. So you're being asked to trust the process, to realise it's moving forward. Don't focus on the when, just know it's coming. You're coming into union. It's all falling into place. I am your link between heaven and earth. Between your humanity and your divinity, I am here to help you heal the conflict that exists between your heart and mind. Feel me in your heart and thoughts. Through oneness there is love. So Archangel Metatron is connecting you with all that is, all that was and all that ever will be. Connecting you and your divine masculine together. Bringing you together in love and peace and harmony. And giving you wisdom. Because you're gaining wisdom right now. Everything has a place and everything has a purpose. To be wise is to have great love, tolerance and compassion for all things. And the angels are showing you what's coming in. So whatever's going on in the world this month, rise above it. And remember that you are safe and that you and your masculine are being healed right now. Trust that your masculine is moving this forward towards you because the love is real. And this is the divine love, the divine truth, that your masculine is becoming the emperor for you, that you are strong and powerful, just like the queen of swords, and that they are getting their house in order so they can be the person that you want them to be. And I know it's been stale, it's been stuck, it hasn't been growing, but it's blooming now. And this is why you're being guided to not give up. Even when your masculine gets blinded by the light, they still see you. And they are removing things from their life to be with you so that victory can be yours. So that you can move forward together and have the life of your dreams. It's moving forward. Keep the faith, trust the process and use gratitude as the right attitude because it will set you free so what does your masculine want you to, to know this month you turn me on so never forget how powerful the connection is you are my light even when you're blinding your masculine they are still drinking in that light because they are learning who they are so trust in that this month you're being healed your masculine is with you and you are never alone have a great month sending you so much love and i'll see you soon